After seeing Darby and Speedrun of Super Mario Brothers and looking through the comments, I have concluded that I need to make this video just so I can kind of demonstrate uh, some things that you can do in Super Mario Brothers that a lot of you think is cheating, but it's actually not. To demonstrate this, I will be using my original NES from when I was a wee lad. I also have a Famicom, the Japanese NES, which looks completely different, but I don't have the Japanese version of Super Mario Bros. I have the EverDrive, which is a flash cart, which I can play this on it. But if I use that, then I'm going to be accused of cheating. So, original... Oh. Oh, okay. <sighs> ignore that. <laughs> just, just ignore me almost knocking down my NES. <laughs> Alright, turn the TV on. It's a really old TV too. Which is appropriate because it's an old system. Alright, now let's see if this works on the first try. I doubt it though. No, okay. 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 Looks like you guys can see just fine. Uh, let me get the controller. Right. Now. probably gonna not be a lot of me talking I apologize I'm just trying to focus on just getting to where I'm going just so I can show you guys I'm not gonna edit this version down I might release like a like a short version and put that on too but this is the full version so Get to world four. Okay. It, boom. All right, so this is the part that many people have criticized Darpin over. So I'm just going to show you that it's actually possible to go through the head. Look at that. Look at that. Now I'm going to go back and I'm going to actually hit it. See, I hit the hitbox that time. Uh, in the comments, there are a bunch of pictures people posted about the uh, hitboxes on the enemies. And uh, the hitbox for that is unusually small. So that um, you can pass through the, the, the head and still live. Or, you know, not take damage. So that's one debunked. That's one... That's one cheating accusation that's been cleared up. Now, I'm not sure how I can uh, do the wrong warp. There's a way to do it, but it's slower than the way he did it. So, I, th I think it has to do with uh, tricking the game into thinking you're in a different... Ah, oh, shit. Okay. I think what he did was he hit it right 
as he jumped and then quickly went over there and yeah. See if I can just. I don't know if I can do it. So, okay, there we go. This is the way I learned how to do it. There we go. Now you see that there's no vine there. That's how you know that it wasn't um, like a jump cut or anything. You can try it yourself if you want. Now, this one is the dumbest. I, I'm, I'm completely, completely honest, I think this is the dumbest accusation ever. Look at this. All you have to do is hold the B button while running, and you will run over those little gaps. Like, it, it, this, this wasn't a secret back in the 80s. You, you... <laughs> and, let's see. In the last attempt, I actually did a wall jump. You saw that I kind of uh, gripped it a little bit. I um, <clears throat> just want to see if I can do it real quick, just to end the video. But it has to be, like, pixel perfect, and I don't ha know how to do it. So... No. Okay, I, I gripped it that time. Nope. No, I'm wasting time. Okay. I did it the last time. I might just upload a quick video uh, of the last playthrough. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Now I'm just going to play the rest of this game. Oh, actually there's one more thing that I need to clear up. And I'll be at the end. So... Oh. Oh, well then. I forgot that the time was still going. <laughs> okay. That's cool. I got one life to do this. Uh, I probably could have gotten um, one up there. Whatever. Oh, shit. Alright. Well, I'll probably do another video some other time. Um, and, uh, yeah, so, so, if, if you see a speed run, definitely approach it with some skepticism, but actually do research before you claim it's cheating. That's kind of the message that I'm trying to uh, push here. So, I'm going to go to bed, good night, and, uh, yeah, I don't know how to end this video.